Now, let's see the inside. Boyer, rather large. Into the dining room. Beyond that, the family room. Over here to the right, actually could be the dining room or just a den that opens up into the kitchen. With the deck out back. Stainless appliances, stainless vent hood, stainless dishwasher, stainless sink, painted cabinets, laminate floor here. That's the garage. Excuse me, carport. Two car carport. And here's a large breakfast area with tile. I think this is tile. Feels like tile. And the laundry room, large laundry room, with the window and shelving. Bench here at the bay window, with the deck down to the basement level there. Large deck. Pool. Storage building. Mostly brick, a little bit of siding. Lots of trees. into the den, which also has double doors to the deck. There is your basement entry there. Looking back on that dining room and the foyer there. Coat closets here. Bedroom. Stairway up to the second level. All the way down to the other bedrooms. Here's the second bedroom on the left side of the hall. With a standard closet. Couple of windows, Jack and Jill bathroom. Floor, fiberglass single shower stall, toilet, and again, like I said, Jack and Jill. So it connects these two bedrooms the first bedroom down the hallway and the second bedroom down the hallway. This one has one window and a standard closet. And I'm going to go back down the hallway to the master or primary bedroom. Two windows, a walk in closet,
barn door to the back. Window here. Vanity. Laminate floors again. Large vanity. One sink. Big window. Tiled. Bathroom. Now we'll go back down the hallway to the attic or second level. Carpeted stairs. This area has a window unit, even though I see a thermostat for heating and air up here, I do not see any vents or returns in this room, although I see a return in the next room. So, let's see. That was a closet. Bathroom with a window, fiberglass, tub shower combo, vinyl floors, double vanity. This does have a vent. The thermostat. So as you can see, once we came up those stairs, we see a, a large room that's divided into two. And then these are just attic spaces here for storage, rather large. And then on the other side, same thing, storage and access to the heating and air unit. Easy access to change the filters. Now we're going to head back downstairs so that we can check out the lower level. In the family room. Laminate. Steps. Line. This lower level is concrete, painted concrete. Nice wood storage for fires and the fireplace itself. Closet. Windows to the back, view of the pool. Very large room here. This would be a good movie room too. This is a storage room only, I believe. I mean, I guess you could use it for something else, but you'd have to paint this wall and there's no window here. This is the foundation, the block foundation with an open ceiling. Doors to the pool area. This is an area that could be sort of a wet bar slash mini kitchen because there's the plumbing for the sink and there's your drain. This is a mat, a rubber mat, kind of like a workout mat. Not sure what's in that room, can't get the door open. This goes into another basement area that 
is finished and it is heated and cooled. Um, it's a little rougher finish. Same thing here. This is a laundry room. Could be used. And I'm sure that's just another door to the back area. There are bedrooms and baths down this hallway. So lots of bedrooms here. I think it was five or six. Vanity, single vanity here. Another vanity here with the uh, window tiled shower. Looks like a porcelain tub. Storage area. Over there. So this bathroom opens to the hallway and opens into this room, which they had used as an office. Could be a bedroom. It's got slate floors. With a closet, standard closet over there. And two windows. Back out into the hallway or a closet, maybe a linen closet, into this area with a laminate, I believe a laminate squares, or maybe this is tiled, nope, oh, it's laminate, and this is a bedroom, or could be a bedroom, it has a window, it has a closet, a little bit deeper closet than the others, or the other one down here. into a private bath. Tiled floors, marble shower, pedestal sink, and a mirrored closet doors over here for the mechanical room where the other heating and air unit is. There's a water heater in there. And that covers it. Call Donna Matthew 770-480-7933. Thank you.